rehearsal day for one of life's major milestones. Nicole Eileen Basner. What do you think about graduating? I'm very excited. I can't believe it's already here, to be honest. I mean, when people tell you high school flies by, you don't take it serious until you actually get to senior year, and it's like, wow. Where are you headed next year? I'm going to Merrimack College next year. Western New England University. Uh, St. Joseph's College of Maine. Like so many graduating seniors, those here at Windham High School are both excited and anxious about what lies ahead. I'm definitely ready to like explore, see what's out there, but it's also kind of like, here's my bubble. I don't really want to leave it, but it's there's so much more waiting. So, super excited to graduate. Um, I mean, it's going to be a great, you know, next step to the chapter in our young lives. These seniors aren't just taking part in a graduation run through. They're also learning about life after high school at a special assembly led by Concord attorney Jennifer Eber. Can anybody tell me something that changes in terms of the law when you turn 18? Uber, who is with the law firm Orin Reno, had a gift for these soon-to-be graduates, her new book, Beyond High School, A Guide to Your Rights and Responsibilities. Published by the New Hampshire Bar Association, it's filled with all kinds of legal information that impacts these students as they turn 18 and become adults. Jury duty is incredible. If you ever get pulled up for jury duty, do it. There are chapters on things like registering to vote, bank accounts, health and car insurance, and contracts. Now they're 18, they can enter into contracts, so they ought to be looking at the contracts and a lease to see if there are any blanks, making sure the blanks are filled in, uh, making sure that they understand all the provisions of the lease and don't sign anything that they're just unsure about. Beyond High School was first published in 1996. Eber wrote this updated version and added a whole new section on internet privacy and identity protection. Social media is a huge part of our generation, so it's definitely good to know your rights. During her presentation, Eber reminded students to be careful about what they post to social media. It could impact their future employment. Even if you're on private, it could still affect your college education and your career because people can see everything. Hopefully they'll take the book and, and be armed with the tools they need to think twice before they post something. The drawings throughout the pages of the book are the work of high school artists from St. Thomas Aquinas and Manchester Memorial. Another thing you guys have to deal with that we didn't have to deal with is what we asked you to put away at the beginning, right? Your cell phones. People are going to be watching. People are going to be taking video. You have no control over what people do with those videos. Presentations took place at a number of high schools this spring. At Alfred and Hudson, some New Hampshire bar members who work at Fidelity headed up a discussion centered mainly around financial responsibilities, such as paying back college loans, credit cards, and establishing credit. Your ability to borrow money is a very powerful tool. It's going to allow you to go to college, potentially. It's going to allow you to buy a car and someday hopefully get a home. If you use it wisely, it can be one of your strongest attributes. But on the other hand, if you misuse it and you don't pay attention to it, there could be some really bad surprises down the road for you. A lot of these kids are going to be leaving home for the first time, might not have their parents around. And so this book is not parental supervision or a substitute for that, but it should just educate the kids a bit about what they should expect out in the real world. The book covers military enlistment and the draft. Under law, males must register within 30 days of their 18th birthday or face up to five years in prison and or a fine of up to a quarter of a million dollars. I didn't know it was like that serious, so, but yeah, I did it ASAP, so it's good. You need to find a place to live. What are your rights as a tenant? During Q&A sessions, students sought information about dorm life and privacy rights. Some of the students in their dormitories don't necessarily have the privilege of avoiding unwarranted searches and seizures by school administration, say. Because if there's suspicion of, say, alcohol, drugs, any illegal behavior, then what this can lead to is a bad reputation for the school, damages, things of that nature. Bar 
Association printed up 17,000 books to be handed out to members of the class of 2018. Once they're out on their own, they're out on their own. Uh, they don't have a, an adult that intercedes on their behalf. Scott Harris, New Hampshire Bar Association President and Litigation Department Director of McLean Middleton in Manchester, says the Beyond High School book was distributed in celebration of Law Day to educate students. Hopefully they read it uh, before they uh, have an absolute need for it because a uh, little uh, time for reflection uh, might avoid a lot of problems. So if you act with integrity and common sense, use that good judgment, it will steer you through a lot of questionable scenarios. I feel like this is going to help me a lot within my future when I go off to college, when I graduate college, when I move out of my parents' house, when I get my own place. So I thought it was very nice that all these lawyers came in to teach me about the laws and the consequences. I thought it was very useful. I thought that it, it really provided an insight into, how, into the importance of why we need to understand um, this transition period in college life and life after high school. Take what you learn, go out in the world and accomplish and do good things. Thank you. school, the students who received this book believe it will serve as an important resource as they embark upon a new chapter of life, adulthood. Yeah, I'm very reliant on my parents at some times, so it's going to be a huge difference. So. Yeah, it's a big step in our lives that we'll overcome, but it's going to be a lot different at, at the beginning. As you know, a lot of people get out of high school not knowing much about the law or what they're responsible for with payments and things like that, so I think it's really good that they're giving the book out to seniors. Class of 2018, turn your tassels.